Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Today, I have a whole bunch of chrome to rip. I got two blaster boxes here and three value packs of the 2020 Topps Chrome, one of my favorite products of the year. I was lucky enough to pick this product up uh, two weeks ago at my retail location. And I'm hoping this week, um, actually this Friday, I'll be able to find some more because I am obviously super pumped about this product. You might have seen my last video, I'll flash it here up on the screen. Um, out of a mega box of this product, I pulled what, what could be argued as one of the best cards in the entire set, it, uh, a Luis Robert um, autograph. Um, it's a redemption, uh, so we'll see um, you know, when I ever get that thing, but I did, I did redeem it and I'm pretty pumped about it. Um, pretty exciting to, to hopefully get that card in sometime soon. So without further ado, let's rip it, let's rip into these packs. Let's see what we got. <clears throat> All right. So we got Trey Turner, nice AJ Puck rookie here. And we, and we got the 1985 Nico Horner and all those cards are pretty cool although a lot of them are off-centered so when you find one of those centered I think it's worth sleeping up and putting away but um, ooh nice Jordan Alvarez gold cup rookie card I have quite a few of those from just the paper series one uh, but uh, it's fun to get those in chrome wishing Jordan ooh that's a nice refractor of Biggio wishing Jordan Alvarez a speedy recovery I guess he's been a little bit injured uh, lately, so we'll see how that how that pans out. Uh, Marcus Simeon, Paddock, and freshman flash of Noisy Noise. Bad at that name. Um, <laughs> so appreciate you guys watching as always. Make sure you hello oh, hey, hello auto incoming. <laughs> nice. This is why the this I mean. I did not pull any autos from any of the top series one, but man, look at this. Jesus Tanako, and we got the Yelich card. I don't know anything about this gentleman. Um, got a nice Pete Alonzo future star there. But that's pretty sweet. Um, yeah, you know, I, I opened so much top series one. Um, you know, that's the set I got back into collecting, and, you know, I did pull one autograph, um, and it was a pretty good one Fernando Tatis Jr. But man, so much product that I opened. With this Chrome though, I feel like like every other box, there's like an autograph hiding in there. I mean, it's pretty impressive. So um, so that's really fun. And so these rookie autographs, they're not that valuable, but you know, who knows? This gentleman might turn out to be a huge star coming up in the next few years. Kind of fun. So I'm just holding on to all these rookie autographs but you know, if you want some some interesting rookie autographs, I've noticed a lot of people are just trying to flip them on eBay. I mean, you can pick up probably all of these for under five bucks each, and just get yourself a nice collection going. Here's nice Brendan McKay. That one actually looks nicely centered, so there's a good one there. But yeah, so I got a nice little stack of these autos. We'll just kind of just see what happens, I guess. It's kind of fun. There's Austin Nola pulled his rookie auto, I think, out of this too. Uh, Reese Hoskins and Vladdy uh, Jr. So, but yeah, very impressed with the product. Um, I just feel like every now and then you can pull some lightning. I'm hoping uh, I do that with these boxes and packs, but we'll, we shall see. There's several cards that I'm still hunting for. I'd love to get Luis Robert in Sepia, Luis Robert in the pink. There's a nice Alzole. That's the prism with an S refractor, I believe it's called. We got Toro rookie card. We got, oh, there's a nice Jordan Alvarez, and you can see that one's a little off centered, but that's been the case with those. So that's his rookie um, 1985 card. So pretty cool. But yeah, this product, it you know basically sells out immediately. Um, I, I'm just I just I'm, I'm able to get there uh, when it's being put on the shelf. Um, so definitely uh, I'm in a good position to be able to do that I've been pretty successful the last couple times hey there you go nice Kyle Lewis I'll take all the Kyle, Kyle Lewis's out of this out of this product for sure um, he's been doing a pretty good job and so 
uh, we'll see how his cards end up uh, as far as value over time. But um, I definitely have a lot of Kyle Lewis from Series 1 just kind of sitting around. So we'll see. Kind of fun. There's nice Gavin Lux rookie card. Uh, Lindor, Chapman, and I'll finish off the pack there. So, yeah, I mean, fighting product is extremely hard. Um, as soon as as soon as it gets put on the shelf, it, it kind of like disappears. And I've seen that with my own eyes. Um, I definitely don't, uh, I'm definitely not one of these individuals that takes everything. I just, you know, I, I, I mean, I can't, you know, I just can't really afford to do that. But um, I do try to grab some of the products that I'm really interested in. So, um, like this last time around, uh, there was a lot of this, that Chronicles basketball, and um, I wasn't that sure about the product. I just didn't really know anything about it, and, you know, I know basketball is always hot, but um, I had opened up some Chronicles football, and I wasn't that impressed with it. So, anyway, I, I let, you know, the other, the other uh, people there just kind of grab that all up, but one of the guys was kind of nice. He's like, here, have some. So, ooh, there's a nice Eloy Elo Jimenez. He threw a couple boxes in my in my, uh, in my my basket. <laughs> so it's pretty cool. Hey, nice, another Kyle Lewis. I'll take that. So anyway, I, uh, I'm excited to open those um, uh, and, and make a video for the channel. But that was pretty cool. And, um, and, and I've recently bought into a couple breaks. And yeah, I'm pretty pumped about NBA Chronicles, so hopefully hopefully I can find some more. Um, but I have already a, a nice pile of really sweet cards. Um, that's primarily mostly from my buddy Justin over at Portal Cards, so uh, kudos to you, buddy, for always finding a cool product and le always letting me buy it from you. <laughs> Alright, we got Alzale. Oh, check that out! Look at that, Eloy Jimenez! That is so sweet! Gold Cup! Oh, negative card! See, this... I've been wanting to pull the Mike Trout negative, but um, Eloy, Eloy Jimenez is a beast, so I kind of really dig this card. Um, I actually just uh, pick, picked up a couple of his PSA 10 rookie cards because I didn't have any in my collection, and um, boy, I feel like his cards are really undervalued. I mean, he's he is a he is an amazing player, um, but of course he's sort of like not getting the attention he probably should just because of like Luis Robert, I think. Um, and his cards, uh, accordingly, I, I think are really undervalued, so um, kind of excited, picked up a, hey, look at that little, I must have a die cut in here, so um, Jake Rogers rookie card there, the Pete Alonzo gold cup right there, and my die cut is, hey, Big Mac, nice, Mark McGuire. So, so yeah, um, yeah, that's pretty cool, actually, I like that gold. So yeah, I mean, uh, Eloy Jimenez, dude, I think he's a good one, so I'm kind of looking for some of his rookies right now, just to kind of add add to the add to the PSA collection, and just kind of see what happens with him. So, uh, let me know in the comments below what you think about Eloy Jimenez, I mean, I think he's definitely worth collecting, so, and I feel like his cards are not too expensive, there's the Eisen Diaz, and we've got the nice Austin Riley Future Star card there. All right, so I believe this is the last pack from all those uh, regular packs. Uh, we pulled one autograph, a couple Kyle Lewis's, and a sweet Elo Jimenez. Um, we got the Travis Demerit and Gratterall rookie card here. So, all right, let's get into the parallel packs. Let me just get these stacked up, put them over here, and we'll get into the parallel packs. Uh, so I had cellos here, so there's pink parallels, and then the blaster boxes have the sepia. So hoping to find, you know, Kyle Lewis, hoping to find Jordan, hoping to find Luis Robert, um, among among other rookie classes, uh, rookie, uh, rookies in this class. So let's see what we got. Appreciate you guys. If you've been watching all the way through, please make sure to leave a comment. Um, hit that like button if you enjoy watching this video. So here we go, we got a Kevin Newman pink, and the pink cards are definitely good looking. Matt Olson, not bad, and to finish that pack, uh, Luis Castillo. Alright, next pink pack.
All right, let's see what we got here. And Edmund, we got the Tim Anderson. And John Means, John Means Gold Cup. It's pretty cool. Not too shabby there. All right, one last pink pack for us. Let's see what we get. Hoping for a Robert. And nope, Jose Abreu got a White Sox. Not the one I was looking for. We got the Yelich and Nelson Cruz. Finish off that pack. Okay, two packs left, guys. These are all the Sepia. Um, I really think these are beautiful looking cards. Oh, I see somebody there on the back. Nice. All right. Glanson, Bryant, and we got Lopez, and boom. Nice. So if you watched my last Chrome video, I've actually pulled this one before. So I, now, now I got some dupes. I got a doubles of uh, Bo Bichette Sepia, which, you know, hey, I'll take that all day. He, he was crushing it before he sprained his knee, um, so hopefully hopefully he bounces back pretty quick But because he, he's been having a great season, but I'll take that. Hey, Brendan McKay, rookie card. I'll take that in the Sepia all day. Vilar, and hey, Zach Collins, rookie card. I just love that image, by the way. I, I've liked this image ever since it was in Series 1, so that's a pretty sweet one as well. So, so I'm pretty happy with the rip. Um, I'm, I'm pretty pumped on some of the cards that I got. I did not get any Luis Robert, but that's okay. But I'm happy with my uh, Ila Jimenez negative card, Kyle Lewis rookie cards, rookie auto, Bo Bichette, Gavin Lux, nice Juan Soto. Um, hope you enjoyed it, guys, and I will see you on the next one.